Hi everyone, I'm Claudia from Home Deluxe and welcome to the channel. Today, the million dollar question majority of my buyers have for me is Claudia, is it the right time to enter into the market now? Concerns such as rising interest rates, increasing prices and cooling measures have resulted in buyers putting a halt in their purchasing plans and prefer to take a back seat to monitor the market situation. Most agents when posed with this question will probably assure you and tell you that this is the best time to enter into the market now. Today, I will not be telling you if it is the right or wrong time to enter into the market as no one is able to predict the future and give a definite answer. However, I have done a series of market research and analysis that I will be sharing with you. At the end of the sharing, you can then decide for yourself if it is or it is not the right time to take action. The most important thing when purchasing a property is the right entry price. So what exactly is the right entry price? On 26 of April 2023, the government announced increases to the additional buyer stamp duty, ABSD rates, which marks a third round of property cooling measure since December 2021. Two days later, on the same weekend, Blossoms by the Park, a new launch in the One North region, was launched for balloting. Naturally, just two days after the announcement of cooling measures, we would expect Blossoms to perform badly for the launch day. Let us take a look at the performance of Blossoms. Looking at the 70% sales on launch weekend, we can tell that despite ABSD increment, Many buyers still believe in the project and continue to proceed with the purchase. Why is it that so many people are taking action after the cooling measure? It all boils down to the right entry price. Let us take a look at and compare the average transaction of the different regions in Singapore. Today, OCR projects have transacted averagely 2001 PSF, RCR at 2007 PSF, and we are predicting CCR to be transacting at 3,005 PSF in two years' time. Blossoms by the Park is a RCR development. While most of the new launches in the RCR are transacting at 2,007 PSF, on launch day, units at Blossom was only 2,003. This makes Blossom a very attractive entry price to buy into as it was averagely $400 PSF below what other RCR projects were asking. Just a bit more on this area, One North is deemed as the Silicon Valley of Singapore and expects that work in this region will form the tenant pool and you'll be renting to them. Hence, rentability will be promising when this project TOPs. By entering at $400 PSF lower than other RCR developments, buyers at Blossom are also in a less risky position in today's market because in the future when they plan to sell, they can exit at 2007 PSF where most new launches are selling today and still make a profit. Imagine today you were to buy a 2 plus study at 872 square feet. You'll be able to cash out $348,000 when you sell at 2007 PSF. But for those people who have bought at 2007 PSF, what prices must they sell in the future in order to profit? Today, as a real estate consultant, my purpose is to let you as my client understand how to find the right entry price, how to ensure you can exit easier than others, and also for your risk to be lower than the others. If today these three pointers are not checked, I would not recommend you to buy now. In conclusion, there's one thing that you should take back from this video is, when entry price is right, there will be a window of opportunity for people who dare to take action. If today you are a buyer who is stuck in a dilemma as to whether to take action or not, or if you wish to find out more about which projects check all of these three pointers, feel free to contact me and I'll be more than glad to share with you more on this. That's all we have for today and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye!